poor lucky one. Everything is and not there going goes to the work. first umbilical tower marking just about T minus thirty five. Should be under thirty seconds away from liftoff. Auto sequence initiated. Auto sequence initiated. Launch command issued for ignition. Second arm retracting. Launch command issued. You can see the engines firing, ramping up. Flight speed. Engines at maximum thrust. The turbo pumps are at flight speed. Standing by. Lift off. And lift off. Jeff Williams, Alexei Ovchinin, and Oleg Skropochka launching to the International Space Station. The first stage of the Soyuz booster delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust from the four strap-on boosters and the single core engine. First stage going to be burning liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds into the flight, passing through the cloud layer. You can see the crew on board. Again, Alexei Ochin in there in the center seat. Getting good reports of first stage uh, functioning throughout the launch so far, just one minute since liftoff. Sixty seconds in powered flight. Your pitch and roll are nominal. Everything's nominal on board, Musk. So as we approach one minute and ten seconds into the flight, the velocity of the vehicle already at about eleven hundred miles per hour. Again, everything continuing to go well with the ascent, uh, lasting just under nine minutes until these three crew members will be in space. You'll see that owl uh, begin to float in the microgravity environment, an indicator of once they've reached their uh, final altitude. On board, and the crew is feeling well. Copy. And then in just a few seconds, the strap on boosters will be jettisoned. And the visiting vehicle officer here in Houston confirming the escape tower has been jettisoned and those four strap-on boosters have also been jettisoned. They've completed their job and will now drop away. Soyuz already at an altitude of 28 statute miles, cruising along in the, at a speed of about 3,350 miles per hour.